Namaste. I'm Aarti Sharma. I head the Women's Indian Wear Department. Uh, what I'm going to showcase to you today is the range from Sihahi. Uh, let me describe a little bit about Sihahi. Sihahi which means ink, which is a signature line that we have put together, uh, which depicts the Indian arts and craft and very traditional motifs and uh, arts from most of the regions of the country. What Siyahi comprises of basically is the collection and the ranges that we put together within which we have indigo, bagaru, kalamkari and south cotton put together. Indigo is basically inspired from the Dabu collections of Rajasthan. They usually come in the blue colours and blue hues and tones that you see along. Uh, what we are going to show you is different kind of prints that we have picked up from the Dabu collections. They are basically from the surroundings of Rajasthan and in and around of Jaipur. Uh, a typical motif, typical prints that we have picked from these areas of the region. Uh, what we are going to show you is a different collection that we have all together which has the tops and the bottoms like I told you earlier. What I am going to showcase and start with right now is the indigo collection in which we have the tops and the bottoms. Within that we have kurtas, tops, tunics and in the, in the bottoms we have churidars, salvars, patialas, skirts and trousers to go with. What I am going to showcase to you today is the ensemble over here that we have. Uh, this is a jacket that we have which is a reversible jacket. It can be, bo it can be worn both ways. Uh, they have different prints on both sides. Uh, it has a wooden button that goes along with it for hookup and you have pockets on both sides of the garment for comfort and ease. Uh, we, what we have over here along with the jacket is the divided skirts. This skirt is basically a lot of voluminous skirt which is mostly used to be worn by kurt with kurtis and with tops that you have along with it. And inside this we see is a south cotton uh, tunic that we have, a cap sleeve tunic. This is in a red colour. Basically why we've added a red colour or a, why have we added a south cotton tunic is you see a lot of blues that happen in indigo. You don't have a lot of colours in indigo. To break the monotony and to give the customer more choice to pick and choose from and make a collection. That is why we've added, added a few south cotton colours to it. So you will see a, a, a red, a green, a white which will break the monotony of the blue. What we have over here is the kurta and the churidar. Uh, this is a regular 38 length kurta. This has got buta prints on it and it's got geometrical motifs on the yoke. It's got a red putty trim that accentuates the yoke as well as it's got the same geometrical print on the sleeve hem as well. This kurta can be worn with a white churidar or a red churidar as well. Let me show you a few more styles that we have in this collection. We have like this trouser which is a trouser that can be worn with a solid tunic or a cap sleeve or a spaghetti that we have. Uh, let me show you the spaghetti. This spaghetti basically is a solid spaghetti which is a very fitted and a very comfortable style. It has a zipper on the side for, for adjustment and for fit. Then what we have here is a divided skirt. This divided skirt is basically a style in which we have actually stitched on the side so that it is easy for the customer to wear. Then we have some kurtas, a, a stylized kurtas where you have a flap in kurta which is the inner inside it which, is, which can be worn with a nice churidar. Then you have a high low hem kurta which can also be worn either with a denim or a churidar or a trouser. Uh, then the regular kurta as you saw earlier. Then we have few tunics which can be worn with solid uh, trousers that we have in this range. Uh, th these can be also worn with the denims and they can also be worn with skirts that we have. Uh, then we have a white trouser which can also go along in this entire range. <laughs> With this we complete the entire indigo collection. Now we will showcase to you the next collection which is the Kalamkari. Now coming on to the Kalamkari collection. Kalamkari is majorly inspired from the Golconda and the Mughal Sultanates. Uh, this is majorly a, it's originally a hand painted craft and it has a lot of flora and fauna added on to it. Most of the colours that you will find in Kalamkari are only going to be towards the green, maroon, yellow and the black hues in which you will find most of, this, most of these prints in. Uh, this is a collection which completes uh, an entire floral and uh, printed collection in the Siahi range. Here we have an entire ensemble in the Kalamkari collection. 
this is a overthrow or a jacket that we have which has got kalamkari prints it has pleatings on it on both sides of the garment then we have the button down over here to give it a feel and look of a jacket the inner of the inner of the in, inside of this of the jacket you have a south cotton uh, tunic which is which has a button down again it's a button down which has got portly buttons on it uh, then you have the bottom which is a regular plain trouser uh, this can be teamed up basically this can be teamed up as it is or you can wear it with a skirt or you could also wear this with a salwar or a patiala here we have a trouser and a kurta coordinated uh, ensemble in which we have the trouser which is a kalamkari printed trouser this has been teamed up with a south cotton pin tuck uh, pin stripe kurta which is with the yoke of a solid south cotton and even the sleeve trim has south cotton uh, taping on it just like in the other collection here too we have different silhouettes in the range uh, we have a cap sleeve kurta which has a uh, nizam border on it then we have uh, the reversible jacket which you had seen in the indigo collection here too we have a reversible jacket which has pockets on both sides then we coming to the regular these are the regular kurtas that we have in 38 inches length we have tunics that also have that are also available in this range and small short tops to go along with this range we also have the bottoms in this range which we have a patiala printed patiala that can be teamed with the south cotton solid kurtas and we have divided skirt like this it's similar to the one that you saw in the indigo collection the same divided skirt is also available in the kalamkari range We also have another range which is called the Bagru range that I will showcase to you next. The Bagru collection is basically inspired from the Rajasthani prints. Uh, this is a very black and white, uh, black and red collection. Uh, in this, you will have a traditional amalgamation of the black and red on ochre and beige backgrounds. Uh, this is a typical Bagru collection which depicts a rich story in itself. Talking about the uh, range and collection, we have this ensemble over here, which is again a jacket, again a reversible jacket. It can be worn both ways with pockets again. And then we have the uh, South Cotton tunic that can be teamed along with it. This has Nizam borders on it. Then we have the very famous Ghagru skirts that are very, very in these days as well. To explain a bit more about the other ensemble, here we have the solid bottom, a trouser that go, goes along with a printed bagru printed kurta or a tunic with which you, on which you have a contrast yoke and it has a contrast pipe in that goes along and runs through it. Then you have the wooden buttons on the kurta and you have sleeves with a contrast trim of the similar print. Now talking about the rest of the range, this collection is more of print play in which you'll have a lot of mix and match of prints within themselves. Here we have short tops and tunics, which also have different kinds of prints in it. Within the same, within our same dress and our same silhouette, you might have two, three different prints playing together. Here again, you will see different yokes and different prints happening. This is again a border printed kurta uh, with a all over printed uh, body. Then going again, going forward, you have a yoke, which is of a different color print. So most of this range in kurtas and tunics comprise of print play. They do not have much of the embellishment or work that goes on to it, but it's within itself, it makes a entire collection and completes the range.